Hey, what's up everybody, it's your boy Chris. And I know I haven't made a video in quite some time, but I've been debating on getting back onto YouTube and I really wanna talk about stuff that I'm currently working on in my personal life. And one of those things that I've been really into uh, in the past year or so is my personal uh, health, my fitness. And I just wanna basically give like sort of like a testimonial to my weight transformation. Um, so around March of 2012 is when I started to um, look at my fitness, my health as being something that I really needed to work on. Um, at that time, I weighed at, at around 284, 86 pounds, and it was probably the heaviest I've ever weighed in my life. And, you know, I was having issues with like heartburn, um, you know, I was snoring a lot. So my, my sleep wasn't that, wasn't that good. And, um, you know, being uh, overweight or obese um, is not healthy for you whatsoever. Um, the more weight you, you have on you that um, isn't supposed to be there, the more wear and tear you have on your body. And in the long run, it will um, eventually lead to uh, very significant like health problems uh, throughout your life and I just really wanted to make a change um, so as of me making this video uh, and let's see it's July or I'm not I'm sorry not July June of uh, 2023 so uh, about a year and uh, maybe a couple months since I've started working out and dieting um, right now I'm sitting at a, or I'm not sitting I'm a lot of times I'm running um, at, a, at around 255 to like 57 uh, pounds. And I can tell you that I feel amazing. Um, you know, there's a lot of things that I do that um, helps me stay in shape. And uh, one of those things uh, just to start off with is I like going hiking. I like going on trails. Um, you know, on the weekends, I'll try to do maybe a three to four mile uh, trail, but typically on a daily basis um, before work, because I actually started a new job. Maybe I'll make a video about that too. Um, but, you know, the, my new job, uh, there is a really nice park, maybe three or four minutes, uh, you know, detour out, out of the way to getting to work. Um, and I walk it like usually every morning. Um, it sort of gets the blood flowing. Uh, you know, I, I do work as a as an electrical engineer, so there is a lot of sitting at a desk and um, you know trying to stay you know active um, is very important to me. And you know, starting off at the beginning of the day um, sort of sets the tone for the rest of the day. Um, and then also, I can tell you that when I don't do my daily hike in the morning, um, I feel a lot more sluggish um, throughout the day. So it's pivotal for me to you know exercise in the morning. Um, and then another thing that I do a lot of is I run on the treadmill, uh, typically um, at nighttime uh, and on the weekends. Um, usually when I get off work, I will, you know, basically strip, put my running uh, shorts and a tank top on, and I will run anywhere from like 30 minutes to an hour. And typically if I run for like a, a, on average in an hour, I'll do about 4.2 to 4.5 miles an hour on a three incline. So I burn like, I don't know, 900 calories. But then I also, um, you know, cardio is very important, but then also for uh, weight loss, it's important to uh, do weight lifting as well. Um, I do uh, a lot of bench pressing. Uh, I do curls. I do um, the thing where you like push the thing uh, forward with your, like, what do they call it? Like leg crunches or something like that. I don't know, there's like a weight machine in my building that you know I use quite a bit. And, um, and then also I try to um, keep the, like I try to push myself uh, always a little bit, like I'll push myself a little bit and then, you know, and then try to, and then like maybe take 10 pounds off. Um, so there's always a, a, a level of, you know, increasing your, like how much you can lift or whatever. So, you know, that's important. But the number one most important thing that I do by far to lose weight is watching what I eat and watching, like just basically watching what I put in my body. Um, and I, I think that uh, a lot of people think they can exercise 
and not have to worry about you know dieting like oh yeah you just ran the treadmill you burnt like 800 900 calories but then you go eat a bag of flaming hot cheetos or you go eat a you know a whole bunch of i don't know swiss rolls or something like that and that's not good you know you got to really like cut back on sweets you got to uh, you know i don't drink pop anymore that's something that i was like really addicted to um i was uh drinking quite a bit of sprite um when i was back in you know prior to me starting to work out i would usually drink a can of sprite a day if not more um, when i was a kid i would eat like a pound of skittles during like the holidays because people would like literally put in my stocking stuff or, or stocking um you know pound, like a pound of skittles and it'd be gone within a day or two and that sort of translate that sort of followed me into my adulthood where my metabolism wasn't that high and then that's how i got that's how i put on so much weight um, another thing that I do is I uh, meal prep. Um, a lot of people think that you know eating healthy is hard or is expensive, but you know I, honestly I bought a Ninja uh, XL grill and I bought a Ninja dual air fryer that I use probably like twice a week. Um, they're really easy. Well, actually the grill is not really easy to clean, but the air fryer is really easy to clean. But you know I have a dishwasher so. Um, you know, I'll make enough food for not just that day, but then like maybe I'll have enough for like, you know, the next two days for lunch, you know, I'll cook like salmon, chicken, steak, beef, um, you know, trying to like really have like a high protein diet. Um, I also, after I'm done like lifting, I'll, uh, you know, take protein powder. Um, and then also trying to have like a consistent sleep schedule is also very important to, uh, getting in shape and losing weight so um these are all things that you know i've had to uh you know work hard on and you know if you guys have any like questions or comments or anything like that you know feel free to comment below i, I know i haven't been making youtube videos but you know i've been doing a lot of other stuff in life that uh sort of has been not really consuming my time but it's just been more of a focus uh in my life so Thanks for the continued support and I appreciate you guys watching my videos. So have a nice day. Bye-bye.